brand new Pals Holiday Package, now available at DennisDaily.com. I just want to get her down, and then we'll deal with it later. Um, I was thinking... Oh my goodness, what? Oh! Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for episode 6 of Dennis Sucks at Minecraft? Because I sure am. And I'll tell you exactly why. If we hop on into our world here, let me show you. Where did we leave off last? Well, we left off at, actually, first off, is this smelted? Oh, 64 glass. Thank you very much. And, 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 what else do we have? We have 64 stone. Let's go on ahead and turn that into uh, some stone of bricks. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay. So, we come on out here. And if you guys checked out the last episode, if you haven't, definitely go ahead and do that. Um, that would be episode five. We started working on our house. And now here in episode six, I have the two big things that we're going to accomplish today. Zombie, what the... Where did I hear that? No zombies allowed in this side of my town. Ooh, egg. Okay. This kind of had the right idea. It was, it was a step in the right direction. However, it's not... It's not quite there yet. It's not exactly what I was thinking. So, I'll leave these logs here for now. These ones here. This is a good little, little reference point. But, I think I know exactly what I'm going to do. It seems like the main thing with typical Minecraft houses is they are extremely simple. But you don't really notice that they're really simple. Because it just all comes together really nicely and it looks good. Uh, and so I think I have a pretty rough idea of how I can maybe capture that. Uh, so that's what we're going to try. Because um, I was going way too far with it. I was just immediately trying to put in the detail and trying to see what I could do with different amounts of depths and logs and um, and like, just like using different materials when I think in the end, really, oh, is that the end of my axe? Oh, man. Nah. We do have a crafting table right here. Yeah, sure. Well, why not? Let's do it. We'll just make a stone axe for now. It's fine. It's better than nothing. There we go. And then, uh, yeah. So we're going to try that. I think we're going to first try to get the feel, rather than placing down any more blocks, because I was making the mistake of trying to build everything all at once. Let's perfect the front. We'll be like, okay, yeah, this is the look that we want. This is good. And then we can keep that consistent throughout the rest of the house. So I'll still keep these pillars here because I still think I want this kind of rough shape. So first off, I think I want the front more extended out as if it's kind of presenting itself as the front. So, let me show you what I mean. More of these, these stone bricks, yeah. And then this wood, a lot of that we can actually just convert to normal wood. Because I think I've decided that's kind of what I want is the outside. If we were to put... This could be the little deck area. If I were to place this out like this, right? And then... This ended up being... The entryway so if we put up now some probably some fencing would go good there unless we just went with the bushes I think some fencing how do fences go again so I need some more sticks just so I remember it wasn't just like this was it no because they changed it they now made it that's a gate like this oh yeah 15 fences ought to do it for now uh... I like that. Could I do pillars coming up? Keep it open. I think I'm going to keep it open. Now we can do this. That'll give us four of those. Can I maybe just put it out like that? That could look okay, but then I don't know how well it would go with the bushes on the sides. Okay. I think it's worth going and getting the bushes real quick. I'll quickly grab those. Is there anything else I need? I feel like I might need to get more wood. Uh, maybe not though. Okay, I think I know where I went wrong here. If I get rid of this, keep it a consistent outside. Oh, but that's going to be in the house. Sorry, hold on. Hold on, guys. I'm still figuring things out here. That's part of the house. That's going to be a wall there. Meaning, um, what do I want to keep is like the look. I think this is what I wanted, right? So I go like this. And then, no, that wouldn't be the wall. Sorry, sorry, sorry. This would be the wall. There we go, like that. Um, 
Yeah, that's looking good. That's coming together. And then we could totally just put like bushes here all around. That's kind of where I wanted the glass too though, right? I guess I'd have the glass around this way. Yeah, let's see. Could be like this, right? How peculiar, how interesting. Where exactly we're going to be going with this? Yeah, eh. Because you know, you go something like that. What would the glass do? The glass would probably be like this, right? I'd want it to be like a dome. So maybe I wouldn't have these logs. Maybe I would keep it as domey as possible. Maybe I'll bring the logs back. I don't know yet though. I'm just kind of I'm playing around with it. Maybe I should keep the logs and then they will act as a frame for the glass, just like this. So what I do, it's really quite simple, you see. I go log here. Mm. Yes, 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 yes. Very good so far, if I do say so myself. Because I can imagine the garden extends into this room. It doesn't solely exist within just this room. It's already becoming dark again. Oh my goodness. Okay. So it'd be like this height. But it wouldn't go out all the way, you know? I don't want it to... Something like that, right? What if it does go out all the way? And then that way, it's a better frame. I feel like that could make more sense. Do you guys know what I'm saying? Because then that would have some sort of top to it. I mean, ideally just glass is the top, right? <laughs> Did you just give me an egg? Why, thank you very much, sir. I'm stuck on this and it's becoming nighttime, but I really need to figure this out. Okay. For now, I'll put the stairs here, because I still think that's a decent idea. This, though, I'm now kind of wondering about. I'm not too sure if this is the right move. Unless I go glass, get rid of the glass down here, and put wood there, along with, like, that's how the rest of them would go? I don't know. Let's go back to the house. We'll figure this out, guys. Don't worry. It's going to be all right. While it's nighttime, we might as well go get some obsidian. I think that's a great idea. We have a diamond pick. We have the resources required. Let's do it. Mr. Zombie, I have no time to deal with you right now. I need to go back into my hidey hole. Please, Mr. Skeleton, don't do this. Uh, no, ow, 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 ow. Please, 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 I don't want anything. I don't want it, I don't want it. Okay, let's see. Diamond pickaxe, thank you very much. Um, what else can we get rid of? Can we get rid of this stuff. I do want the leaves. I'll take the leaves. I'll take the leaves for now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Good stuff. Get rid of that. Um, building materials. Might as well keep those on me. All the building supplies. Gotta be careful though because I am going into the depths. Might as well keep a door on me too. Don't know what kind of door I'll use. This door seems pretty nice though. This all seems fine for now. Oh, we'll need leather. That's why we should have been farming couches. We need leather so we can make bookcases, so we can make the enchantment area. That was, I really messed up. That, I should have kept the cows. I think there's still some cows alive. We can still farm them. Hopefully, we'll need to make a cow pen. Ugh, I don't know, something like that. Okay, keep those, keep that. Yes, 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 very good, okay. We're gonna finally get that obsidian. We're gonna get 10. So I can make a nice looking nether portal. Actually, no, technically we only need, hmm. Well, actually, technically you could do 14 if you wanted to make the full thing. You only need 10. And then the way I'm planning on making it, I think it's totally fine only getting 10. Ouch, okay. So right here, perfect. That's all the obsidian we're gonna need. Um, you two though, I don't like that. I don't want any surviving obsidian. I take no survivors. There we go. See that there? And then, next thing you know. How long does obsidian take? Is it not nearly as long now? It seems to be breaking fairly quickly. This seems to be a lot faster than... Than what... Huh. Okay. That mine's pretty fast. I remember obsidian taking like literally forever. So I don't know if they increased it or not. Maybe just because I got this here diamond pickaxe. <laughs> okay, 10, right? That's what we need, 10. Is there any lava below this? Okay, I'm just being very skeptical because, you know, there could be lava directly below and then it falls in the lava and then we lose the obsidian. It's not going to happen though. It's going to be fine, right? Everything's going to be okay. 
I'm not gonna accidentally fall into the lava myself, lose all these building materials. Hmm? Hopefully not. Here we go, though. We are now to solid five. Halfway there. Not bad. We haven't been here for too long, so it's gonna be all right. And then we can actually start working on the... Do we need more obsidian for the enchantment table as well? Don't you need obsidian to make the enchantment table? I just heard something's bones break. Is there something near me? Hello? That's what I thought. That's right. Let me see. There's a recipe book here. Can I make any sort of... Uh, where's the enchantment table? How did... That doesn't... I don't get it. I don't get this whole recipe book thing that they added. It doesn't seem to be like... It's like I want to look up how to make something, not... What just make whatever I do. <coughs> there is lava directly below this, but it's totally fine, man. No worries at all. Please just fall into my arms, not into the lava. <sighs> okay. Stuff. Okay, now we're gonna go to here. Just in case, I want to get three more obsidian because I have a pretty good feeling you need obsidian to make an enchantment table. I very, very roughly remember that. We're at 10. I'm just gonna nab three more just while we're here. Just a real quick nab. It's gonna be all right. Because I'm pretty sure to make an enchantment table, you need two books, three obsidian, and a diamond. I could be wrong. I could be absolutely wrong. But just in case, we might as well try. Come on, guys. Just two more. One. <laughs> Okay, just as long as this seems, this is too dangerous. I don't, I don't approve of that at all. <laughs> okay, here we go. Now we can just get one more. We'd never have to worry about obsidian again, ever, in our entire lives. Yes, okay, good. We have 13, that's all we needed. And we out of here, boy, let's go. Okay, where did we come from? Was it over there? Was that the ravine? I don't know. Uh, uh, hello? I don't know where I am. Oh, lots of coal, though. Let's just get that real quick while we're right here. We do need some more coal. There we go. Little by little at a time, the next thing you know. Oh, how wonderful. And then we can make our way back up. Oh, that just mines so quickly. Thank you, diamond pickaxe. Oh, wow, I should really use you more often. Now, where is the ravine, though? I don't know. Hit, yeah. Over here somewhere? Maybe up here? Yoo-hoo! Ooh, nice jump. Okay. No, this is a dead end. I'm lost. Lost in the cave. That's just great. Um, where did I come from? Did I come from here? It just feels like I'm going more and more into the depths. Mr. Bat? Uh, I kill you. You just get out of here. I keep hearing your little squeaks. I've had enough. That was kind of cruel. Oh, <gasps> this looks promising. A little something like this, a little bit of a ravine right there, a little bit of an escape right here. Not so bad. And then we got 34 coal, that is fantastic. And 13 obsidian, let's not forget that. So now, if we make flint and steel, we do have flint, the little, little thingy, the arrowhead. Let's see, go in here, flint, then we need one of those. And then we can go on ahead and make ourselves one of these. Go to bed. Oh, this is going to be so productive. I'm going to be so happy. And then this is everything I need for building, uh, including the spruce leaves. And that's all right, sir. And the door. Oh, oh, I accidentally dropped some meat. Thank you. Okay, now is a better time than any to go make our nether board. Oh, I'm so excited for it finally to be done. Okay. Come this way. And I am going to make a very nice little path up to the nether portal. We're not going to worry about that right now at this exact moment because I just want to get her down and then we'll deal with it later. Um, I was thinking... Oh, my goodness. What? Oh. Well, okay. One, two, three. How many creepers is that? What is going on? There's a zombie with enchanted armor over there and a creeper as well This is in my home area. You guys are gonna blow up my land. Okay here. It's right there That's where I want it. I want it right there in that hole. I need some stone though I need stone to make it seem natural unless I don't have it right like perfectly visible I could put it like right here. This is a cool little area no creepers chasing me. See, look. 
come up here we got this interesting mysterious cave and then in here there's a creeper get out of here creeper you were not welcome here there. Whew, that was close okay uh anything in here anything worth exploring there's another creeper in there Ugh. um thing is i kind of want the portal to be visible you know what i mean I want it to be like right here. I need some normal stone to give the illusion that it's completely natural. It's sort of the whole idea. I can put it right here, you know? Put it right here. And then, you know, make it look real nice. Because look, if we put, put it there, check this out. It's going to look bad right off the bat, okay? It's not going to be anything special at all. But if you just give me a chance, just give me a second. Gotta be careful with placing these. Don't wanna don't wanna mess it up. One, two, three. Okay. Now look. We can light this. It's going to make you know what? No. We're not lighting it yet. Because we're not done here. I'm only lighting it when I am ready to go. When I am well not ready to go to the nether, but ready to ready to say yes, this nether area, this is complete. This is our this this is what we envisioned so we need to cook up some stone we'll cook up some stone and then we can continue on with the house what i'm actually going to do is i'm going to start making we have some cobble on us we might as well get some furnaces going how many furnaces are we going to want in the end probably eh, at least five might as well make it six good six furnaces where are these probably going to go probably in here somewhere um and if we're going to have a white floor, which I still think is a good idea. Would that go well with the wall? Let's see. Let's make the wall on this side here. So go like this. Would it though? Would it go like that? No. <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay, hold on. So we go here. We can put another pillar. Yeah. So that goes around on the side. Something like that. Now we are gonna have windows, obviously. Let's not disregard that. Because then that would stay, that would remain like this. That's the little, that's the little deck. If we put the leaves down, will this look better? Now? Is this what we wanted? Doesn't look so bad. Um, I could see it whenever it all comes together and stuff. Might not look so bad at all. I just don't know about this pillar right here. That's the only thing. It's kind of I'm a little bit skeptical about it. I don't think it would really fit unless I had a balcony on top of this, which I probably won't. So it might be good to have like two entrances into this. How does that look though? Just like that right there. Not the best. Not the fan of that depth there. Unless I had it like this. This might actually look better if I go boop, boop, boop. Yeah, I'd say that probably looks a little bit nicer, you know, not so bad. So if I cut this down, I think that's a nice little, uh, you know what I should really be doing right now? I should really be smelting all of the, the stupid, uh, the stone. This can be our temporary little kitchen area or something, I don't know. Uh, yeah, it's probably gonna end up something like this. We're just going for it. Yeah, for now, guys. Okay, eight there. Probably have one left over. Um, can I actually speed that process up by dividing that? There we go. Okay. Um, hmm. Once that stone is smelted, then we can finish that up right there. And it's going to be great. Trust me, guys. Um, this would go here. See, that looks a little funky right there. I don't know if I like that. Seems like a little bit much, you know? I do like this little porch idea for sure. Is this gonna be wall right here? I think so. I think this would end up being wall, wouldn't it? This would end up being wall. <laughs> All right, you know, something like that, something like that right there. Maybe that's too much bush. Maybe, maybe not. Mr. Chicken, is this your house? Yeah, I didn't think so. You know? Something's coming out of it. This is turning into something. I'm not sure what, but it's better than nothing. Oh, actually, hold on. I think I know what the issue is. I think I gosh darn know exactly what the issue is. It is this right here, isn't it? Isn't it? Hmm? Is that what was needed? Um. 
maybe. This is gonna be part of this area right here. Wow, this is gonna get confusing. Okay. If this is going into a wall here, and then this wall should be out here, this way. Uh, oh boy, okay. Hmm. 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 I'm not sure exactly what is expected of this right here. Because then what's going on over there, you know? Is it just more wall? It's difficult. Very, very difficult. I don't really get how this whole symmetry thing works. Because now it's also not actually an even deck, which is okay. That's kind of fine, actually. If anything, we can then move it over to... More, more over this way, you know? Yeah, yeah, you know, it's not so bad. Okay, cool, we got some... We got some smelted stone as well! So we can come back over here! What exactly are we gonna be fixing up first, though? Probably around the portal. Because this, we can have a path leading upwards. So that's gonna require a little bit of landscaping. But for the most part, we want that closed off. That closed off. That closed off, actually. Make it look a lot more cave-like, you know? Huh? Okay. Would have been nice having one more stone. <laughs> um, ooh. Well, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good, you know? It's not bad. Especially if I put a torch there. Could use some more stone. But, ladies and gentlemen, here it is. Our nether portal. And on that note, I would like to thank you so much for joining me for another Minecraft video. If you enjoyed, please do remember to leave the video a like, maybe even subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and don't forget to check out the PALS Holiday Package, link in the description below, or just go to DennisDaily.com. But other than that, I will see you guys in the next one.